I'm gonna start recording. Introduce yourself and tell me what happened. Hi, Chris Kelly. I was Germany on board two last night. Uh, Russia was John Gramila, who famously had soloed as Italy the game before. So everyone kind of figured, well, people are going to gang up on Russia. Nobody ganged up on Russia. Oh, of course um, not. Every, the, the, the other Eastern powers began. I, Austria, no, Italy attacked Austria right away. Um, and so an RT formed. Um, and Turkey worked with Russia uh, very closely and kept them very, relatively even and built. Meanwhile, Germany and France took out England. Mm -hmm. uh, but it was slow going, crawling up the island. And as we we're going up the island, we were totally prepared. When's John coming after? When's John coming <laughs> after us? And uh, just before we finished off England, Turkey finally, after having slowed up Russia and begging, I'd say, I'm really nervous. Don't don't take any, you know, don't get too far ahead of me because I'm nervous. I'll, I might attack you. And Gramilo hesitated for a turn. And that turned out to be fatal because Turkey turned on him. And right after that, England and France were, I mean, Germany and France were able to start moving units over. Okay. Uh, convoyed, uh, I convoyed a French unit from Yorkshire to Norway. Um, as Germany, so you're pushing Germany, England yeah. up around. Which was basically you. the way of evacuating yeah. England. Okay, so right. Get, 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 but you got France there. into Scandinavia. Yeah, so we got France That's into Scandinavia, and uh, at that point, John basically started pulling back and just. Who was France? Uh, France was Carlos Trevino. Okay, I don't know Carlos. Um, I, I gotta meet him now. And, That's pretty uh, sexy. So we, we were able to roll. Through. And at that point, Russia basically would rather let us have the units than okay. let Turkey have them. Ah, okay. So he kind of invited us into his space, and right. uh, that's how he fell Germany, back. So, so. so Germany wound up being the dominant force in the north, along with France on the both sides. That's crazy. That is that France and Saint Petersburg. Yeah, France. France, uh, France that was had units in. Uh, Norway and St. Petersburg. Wow. And also it was all Picardy through the south. And, and all of, owns all of the boot. Yeah. And, and uh, remind me who was Turkey? I'm sorry, you said. That, that was Carlos Trevino. All oh, right. And uh, Turkey, oh, Turkey was Christian McDonald. Oh, France Christian was, McDonald. Fra okay, France was Carlos Trevino. Wow. And, uh, so just the three of you left at the end of the game? I believe so. We might have, I, think, I don't think we left anyone else on the table. It uh, doesn't look like that. And so what was the dot count at the end? Um, I believe, oh, this is the other thing. So we were trying to, there might have been one survivor from Italy. Um, it doesn't. He does have a unit on the board. Maybe he owns Rome. He owns Rome. Yes. Because what happened? Oh, so trying France to set up 11, 11, 11, so, one. No, no. Um, Turkey wanted to know, wanted to draw, and uh, asked Carlos and I what well, what we were aiming for as far as centers. Ah, okay. And so we agreed that we would be even. Okay. And there was a miscommunication between France and Italy on the last turn, and he wound up one shy. So yeah, I think I had fourteen. He had thirteen. And okay. I, I asked him, I said, do you want to play an extra year just to try and even it up? And I have a, a fleet in Wales, and uh, he owned yeah. Liverpool. Okay. So I could e I, it would have been very easy for stab him, to stab him for a few more. Okay. I would have actually, I told him after that, I would have been willing to try and keep it even. Okay. Um, but I would have been very tempted. Yeah, so he, he saw the temptation and figured he better just take the, the 13 and go home. 14, 13, 1, 6... No, Turkey has more than that. So, Turkey has three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, did you really have 14? I might be, I might be discounting. I had one more than he did. Okay. That's, that's so, <laughs> it sounds to me like about a 30-point board top. Okay. So, here's my question for you. In this position here, with France... Oh, I had 12. I had 12. 12 and he had 11. Okay, that makes more sense. Because now I know, I, I looked at the board afterwards, because I think Trick was saying, oh, I could have soloed. And I looked at it, I can see 15, but the last three would have, I would have had to get, I could have taken his uh, Scandinavian units. Well, if you get into Burgundy, right, I'm looking yeah, at the map Burgundy, here. Burgundy if maybe you walk gets me into Burgundy, right, and then you get Liverpool, you should be able to take St. Petersburg and Norway from him. Yeah. That's one, two, 16, three. 16, yeah. So that's three that you don't have. You probably aren't going to get anything off of Turkey, but you can hold Turkey. That's interesting. So now here's my question so, but, for you. It really, if it would have been a matter of if, how, how much Carlos wanted to fight me. If he, Even if, if he, he Turkey, did he want a, to fight you. total alliance to stop yep. me, I don't think I could have gotten the last two. Okay, but here's a question for you. If you have 16, and if it's 16... Eight, nine. That's a much bigger score. I'm not here for the score. Ah, 
See, people play for different reasons, and that's something that's important I, to I, understand. I play each game for itself. I, I okay. can understand the scoring system. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, let me recommend one of my other videos for you, Some of Squares on How to Play It, yeah. which uh, I have up on YouTube right yeah. now. So I, I, have the, I have the mathematical competence to understand it if I wanted to. I do not want to. Yeah. I do not care. It's interesting because... I play because... each game to enjoy the game, and I'm not interested in the standings or... Okay. That is great because I did, you have I, a I top. I did briefly feel yeah. great that I, I topped the board. Right. Um, and then I realized, so I thought, oh, maybe I'll make the finals. Then I thought, oh, wait, there's 11 boards. There's 11 board tops every round in four rounds. Yep. Board top ain't nothing special. It ain't. <laughs> and, and exactly. And a board top were only over, over your head of your partner by one. Yeah. Right? Um, in some systems, so, yeah, that's if enough. I, if, I were more, if I were more interested in self-promotion... And... Right. If, you were, if your goal when you set out can come to this tournament was to make it to the top table, you play that yeah, end I game very more, differently. Yes. And I think that's something that a lot of players don't understand, is that not everybody has the same goals at the beginning of the yeah. game. And so they might misjudge you, right? Mm -hmm. um, and in this case, you got a good result. Yeah, it's really sad, actually, one of the ironies was, so John Kermila coming off of the solo, all he wanted was a decent result. All he needed to do was survive, and so he, he didn't quit when he, he was ahead. And <laughs> was there was there a draw vote when he was still alive? I believe it might have been. Actually, there was, it was it was a running joke between us, John and kept on joking to Carlos and myself uh -huh. that he would have been happy to draw an O two O three once we had, once he had seven eight units. He was sure, he's like, let's end this. And, but, uh, and then we said we actually we're okay with an with an early draw too. You know, go, huh. go home and have lunch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Um, and uh, but he you know, he did not go for a draw until he was already on the decline. Right. And then Turkey didn't want to do a draw. Sure, so. because he was going to get those dots. Yeah. All right. Well, hey, thank you very much. That's, That's really interesting. That's really good.